how, trauma, do you define, how do you trauma, define trauma? Trauma is an injury, is a wound. Mm-hmm. It's something happens to you that is too big for your mind to comprehend. It's overwhelming by definition. It's too much. And so that because of that, um, the consequence of that is that you get stuck and things keep coming back and you get overwhelmed again and your mind and your brain and your being is incapable of comprehending and making sense out of that event. And because you cannot integrate it, it keeps coming back. Okay, so you're defining it primarily, if I'm understanding correctly, as how people respond to the event. Absolutely. So it, the event is not the trauma. No. Okay. It is no something that uh, people make a big deal out of that. Something that may be traumatic for me may not be traumatic for you. Huh. But the sort of traumas I see, I'd be very surprised if people wouldn't get blown away by that. Mm-hmm. Huh? Like. If you're responsible for going through a red light that causes a car to plow into you and to kill your kid, mm-hmm. I think most people would have a hard time with that. Mm-hmm. If you see your wife getting raped by somebody in front of your face, I think most people would have a hard time with that. Mm-hmm. So the notion that, oh, it's only vulnerable people who get that is a little bit of naive thing. Everybody knows mindfulness is terribly important, but mindfulness is not the be all and end all. In order to have a mind, you need to be mindful. And then you need to use that mind in order to do things. So as long as you cannot be mindful, you cannot do therapy. Uh, But so you have to be mindful. Trouble is that when traumatized people start to try to become mindful, they run into a mind field inside because all that trauma sits inside of you. And as you get to know yourself, you get to see how much you hate yourself, you loathe yourself, you can't stand what you have done or how weak you are. And so it becomes very painful for people. And so, so, so that gets in the way of resolution of stuff. So mind, mindfulness is different than mindfieldness. Right, yes, exactly.